White people with a diploma. Thomas Jefferson. Extra soapy sponge baths. Impossible meat. These are all the things that make up America. This year's election is definitely a big one for America. That's true, this election is gonna decide who's gonna be the next president. And this one is extra important because um, there's, no one knows how this is about to turn out. That's a good way to put it. Um, so basically what we're gonna be doing today is we are, um, we're, we're two educated dudes two sophisticated um, aspiring politicians I just want to say off the bat you look quite dapper in those uh, glasses thanks dude I think that that beret really brings out the, the politician in your eyes thanks dog thanks dog that's definitely what's up um, so guys tonight is the night of the election um, and as two um, politics we would love to watch this debate or watch watch this election I mean so let's uh let's get into it which one do you think is gonna win not sure yet um, we'll see them yeah there really is no way of telling at this point Oh yeah, I actually have to use the bathroom real quick. I'll go for it. I'll hold it down over here. Thank you. Biden at the grave of his son, Bo, then last minute campaigning in his all important home state, Pennsylvania. Tonight, the path to 270, the key states to watch. Our team in all of the critical battlegrounds. Early voting shattering records. Over 100 million votes already cast before today. But late word, hundreds of thousands of mail-in ballots delayed. The reminders of the raging virus everywhere. Voters wearing masks and lines for voters right beside lines for tests. Across the country, cities on edge, businesses boarded up, the National Guard in places on alert for potential unrest, and the uncertainty. Will we know the winner tonight? Not too or sure what is going on in this exact scenario, um, but it's it's looking it's looking like pretty pretty um, dope all around. Yeah, I'm feeling the vibes. I, I, I actually see a lot of uh, a lot of colors. There's there's the red, which represents the Republican Party, and the blue, which represents D. Yeah. There's a whole lot of D in this country, um, based off what we've seen in previous elections. I don't think he meant to phrase it like we've seen a lot of D. I meant we've had a lot of D, my bad. That's not. So we hope you guys um, heard what we put out and went inside of you, and then we hope that what that was that that um, helped you make a better decision towards who you're gonna vote for in this upcoming election that just happened. Word. Um, so guys, yeah, it's very important to get out and exercise your right to vote even after the election ends. Um, so yeah, guys, that's gonna, that's gonna wrap it up for today. Yeah. Peace.